fantastic Friday. I'm Tori, and this is Hutto Elementary's Tiger Talk. And I'm Sandra. Today is Friday, February 25th, 2022. We are here to ha- to make sure you know what is happening at Hutto. But first, we need everyone to stop what you're doing and take a moment for the Pledge of Allegiance and the moment of silence. Ready, salute, pledge. I I pledge pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now please take a moment to think about the kind of day you would like to have. Now it's time for the most important thing. Let's hear about today's lunch menu from our kitchen correspondent. Today our chef and the characters are preparing chicken and waffles or special of the days, sweet potato waffle fries and vegetable of the day. Don't forget you can purchase ice cream for one dollar. Be sure to thank our lunchroom staff for all all their work this week. That sounds delicious. Today is an important day for some of our students and our staff. It's time to wish some very special people a happy birthday. Happy birthday to Gisela Nundren, Elizabeth Hughes, Clayton Glass, Eden Maris, Jerry Scripsey, and Chase Stevens. We hope have a great birthday. Happy birthday tomorrow to Elena Watch. Have a great birthday weekend. Happy birthday to all of you. Now let's learn how we can each be our very best, which will help make our class, school, and world a better place. Being proactive means taking control of actions and reactions. You are in charge of you, and nobody else can make you do something. You make your own choices. You choose to be happy or sad. You choose to get upset upset about something or to not let something bother you. A proactive person uses proactive language. For example, you should use phrases like, I can, I prefer, I will, and I get to. On the other hand, a reactive person says things like, I have to, or if only. They think other people influence their choices and therefore they are not responsible for themselves and they always blame others. Blaming others for your choice is not being proactive and will not help you to be a better person. Instead, choose to be in charge of yourself and to be proactive and you will be much happier. This month we are celebrating black Americans who have not gained the recognition they should have because of the color of their skin. Pay attention as we introduce introduce you to some amazing people. Hello, my name is Chuck Berry. I'm the father of rock and roll. And one of my most famous songs are well, some of my most famous songs are Johnny Be Good, Maybelline, Too Much Monkey Business. Listen to one of my most famous songs. We have talked about self-aware 
that means that you know how you are feeling and oh are aware of what you are doing or about to do remember that you are the person in control of your actions words and behaviors you have to manage your own behavior Stop worrying about how others be, are behaving and manage your own behavior. It is your job to be aware of your behavior and to manage your own behavior. You know what is right and what's wrong. Each of us start off the week with a 100 in conduct and it is up to you if you will keep it or not. That, it, that means if you do not earn this week, Friday reward then you made choices that you really need to think about now it's time for us to sign off we'll see you next time on Tiger Talk